Look at your top stories now. During this week's homecoming for Thompson High, students are still making sure the family of Nyla Tut is a part of their activities. Nyla died unexpectedly this week, and yesterday, family and friends held a balloon release in her honor. People say her impact and legacy is now changing the way they choose to live their own lives. Those closest to her knew she had health issues, but that never held her back from living life. Her family is now asking for prayers at this time. The Edgefield County School District is remembering a high school teacher who passed away last week. The district says Jacqueline Ballard worked at Strom Thurmond High School for three years. It says she'll be remembered for many things, especially the kindness and compassion she shared with everyone. Tonight, Richmond County Schools are hosting its Teacher of the Year Banquet and Award Ceremony. The five finalists are Terry Green at Lucy Laney High School, Dr. Lawanda Lovett, Cunningham at a Brian Mary, a Brian Mary Elementary, rather, Tawanda Marbury at Parton Chapel, San Qual Sampson at Jenkins White Elementary and Andrea Smith at Glen Hills Comprehensive High School. This will be at 7 o'clock at Augusta Marriott at the Convention Center. This morning, former MLB and NFL player, author, and ESPN sports analyst Brian Jordan is going to be visiting elementary schools in Richmond County. Jordan will be reading a book to students and encouraging them to read in and out of the classroom. He'll then return to schools to reward the school and students who meet or exceed their reading goals. This will be at 8 o'clock. James Brown's 90th birthday is being recognized year long, and today there will be a jam concert to celebrate. The James Brown Academy of Music pupils will perform starting at 1230 in the ITC Auditorium building on Augusta Tech's campus. They'll play classics from the Godfather of Soul.